Hey boys and girls, my name is Mac Comer. I am Knoxville's Dean of Fun, and today I'm gonna to read Colors All Around. So what I want you to do is, you can read along with me. I'm gonna use the arrow key, this little arrow, and while I'm reading, I'm, I'm gonna actually point to the words. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read it first, and then, that way, when I'm done, you can go and try to read the book by yourself, okay? You can always reference back to this video for help. So let's try it out. Colors all around. Now you do it. Colors all around. By Jim Loeb. Illustrated by Al Lorenz. Good. So that's a good practice. Let's try it again. Red. Blue. Now let's stop here. Is there something that you see on this page that is red? Mm. Yeah, if you said the vase is red or the kitchen towel is red, then you were correct. What about blue? Do you see anything in this picture that's blue? Okay, if you said the door, then you were correct. The door is blue and the placemats are blue. Let's go on to the next page. Yellow. green. Now let's take a second to go back to this word yellow. Can you find anything in this picture that might be yellow? I'll give you a second. If you said the sofa, then you are absolutely correct. You know what? I see something that might have a little bit of yellow. I can't tell if it's yellow or gold. I don't know. But if you were maybe thinking like, the lampshade looks like a light yellow, or even I see a little bit of something here. That looks maybe like it, hmm, it's either gold or yellow. I don't know, but that sofa is definitely yellow. What about the word green? Do you see any green things in this picture? Okay, so if you were looking out the window, you might see some green bushes or trees. If you're looking on this table, you might see a green plant. There's a green sofa. Anything else? Ah, in the painting, there's pictures of flowers with green leaves. Very good. I didn't see that one at first. Let's go on to the next one. All right, page number six. Orange. Purple. Good. So if you said orange after I said orange and then purple after I said purple, then you are doing just fine. Great job, kids. So anyways, let's go to the word orange. Can you find something that is orange in this picture? Aha! If you said this quilt or you could have called it a comforter or a bed sheet either one of those I would have taken any of those answers yeah it has orange in it awesome look at this skateboard underneath the bed it's got some orange ah and it looks like this book has some orange in it the book covers okay well what about this word purple purple do you see any purple anywhere Ah, look at that teddy bear. That teddy bear is purple. Yes, awesome job. I even see right over here, these are called uh, book stoppers, I think that's what we'll call them. Anyways, they hold the books in place. So uh, those are purple as well. That is so cool. Wow. Let's go on to the next page. 
Oh, this is the last page. Okay, so on this last page, the word is pink. Take a look at this page. Do you see anything that's pink in this page? Hmm? If you said the flowers on this tree, then you were correct. Great job, boys and girls. Well, hey, I hope you had fun reading with me today. I had a great time reading with you. Until next time, I'll see you later.